This vase is both very rare and very beautiful. It combines uh, technical features which are unusual in 18th century imperial porcelain made at the Jingdezhen, the, uh, the centre of imperial porcelain production, uh, manufacturing for the court and for other high officials in 18th century imperial China. The rarity comes from the fact that, as you can see in the picture, it combines two sorts of decoration. It combines uh, underglaze decoration using uh, ground cobalt for the blue and ground copper oxide for the copper red colour, uh, a much rarer colour to find being used in the 18th century than underglaze blue, because copper red is very difficult to control in the firing process. Very rarely one finds vases of this kind which are also washed over in a translucent colour to show a different contrast, to show a different effect because this is a display piece made for the highest levels of court, court society. In this case the vase is washed over on the outside with a very pale translucent turquoise glaze and on the inside and on the foot with a lime green glaze uh, which accentuates the blue and the copper red and gives a very rare combination of colours which no doubt would have appealed strongly to an imperial uh, monarch like Chen Lung for whom this was made and indeed whose rain mark appears on the bottom of this vase hand painted in Jingdezhen at the same time as the underglaze decoration was put on. What makes this vase exciting is that it hasn't been seen on the auction market for a hundred years. It comes from a British collection, um, formerly in the Liddell collection, which was a collection formed much of it in China in the late 19th century, and once formed part of a trio of vases of this design, one merely with the blue and red decoration, one with a yellow wash over it, and our version offered here today.